So oh, this is uh, just to show you how to cut tile with cordless tools. It's real simple. I got a rigid um, diamond blade at Home Depot. I'll show you a picture of that, uh, image of that. <clears throat> And that's it on the wheel there, uh, the saw there. It's a cordless saw. I like doing it with a cordless. Um, I worked with uh, electric corded tools before and when they're wet and you can get shocks. So 24, uh, 18 volt ain't gonna give you any shock. And um, the only disadvantage here, you can see the thickness. It's about an inch. And this little wheel on this saw goes in maybe three quarters um, and all I did was um, keep squirting water on the blade as it's turning and you can see all the mud here that's coming from that mostly from this concrete and then to get into the edges because my saw wouldn't do that I used uh, another tool on my uh, edger it's a Ryobi edger 69 bucks and there's a special blade you can pick up at Home Depot show you that one here it actually this is a Bosch blade and uh, if you look down there in the bottom right left there's a red and white squares that shows it's good for cutting tile and that's been working awesome uh, getting in the corners like this here and I'm just going to show you a little bit about, you, you go slow, you cut slow, uh, just put it in like that, see if I can set this camera up so you can watch me spraying it. Um, put uh, paper down on the cabinet so you protect it. What I'm doing here is I'm cutting open for a uh, cooktop. The old one was not as wide as the new one. So, I have to cut it open a bit. Um, let me see, how can I put this camera up here? Try that out. See, hopefully it doesn't fall over too quick. There was really no dust either. You keep squirting it so let's see yeah you can see that there um, you don't want to push it too fast or you can crack it I think I did a tiny little bit of crack in there, so just go slow and lubricate it with water good. <clears throat> 